Hey, my good friends, Sam Haymart with Test Driven TV. Today, we are looking under the hood of the 2024 Lexus RX 500H, the new turbocharged hybrid in the Lexus stable. So we're gonna have a good look under the hood, talk about some of its major technical features, as well as do-it-yourself maintenance service points. The 2024 newer Lexus RX 500h all-wheel drive is the first vehicle from the brand to showcase their all-new high-end turbocharged hybrid powertrain option that takes power and driving enjoyment up a few levels from the base hybrid powertrain in the RX 350h. The powertrain starts with the Toyota Lexus corporate 2.4-liter turbocharged inline four-cylinder engine that features both port and direct fuel injection, a system they call D4S. The engine also has dual variable cam timing and an 11 to 1 compression ratio and by itself offers up 271 horsepower and 339 pound-feet of torque. The big news is that it comes mated to a conventional 6-speed automatic transmission instead of an ECVT like other Lexus hybrids. There's an electric motor sandwiched between the engine and the transmission and an additional electric motor drive unit at the rear axle for all-wheel drive. Therefore, you will not find a mechanical drive shaft between the front and the rear power units. Powering all of the electric motors is a 288 volt nickel metal hydride battery pack, which is located under the rear seat. The total combined system output is 366 horsepower and 406 pound feet of torque, which provides spirited performance and a traditional driving experience with the feel of real transmission shifts. Efficiency is rated by the EPA at 27 miles per gallon city, 28 highway, and 27 MPG combined, running on 87 octane regular fuel. You don't have to put premium in this. Following the airflow, the intake charge starts at the front passenger side of the engine bay, drawn in through a snorkel and a resonator chamber, then into the air filter box low in the front. From there, it travels past a mass airflow sensor into the rear of the engine into the turbocharger. Once boosted, air then travels up over the engine to the front where it's cooled by an air-to-water intercooler and then into the engine through a composite plastic intake manifold. Atop the engine, you can see components of both port and direct fuel injection. A fuel rail for the port fuel injectors is seen somewhat under some components at the front. The large shiny aluminum fuel rail on top along the spark plug coil packs is for the direct injection. Once combustion takes place, the spent air exits through the rear of the engine into the turbocharger, which features an electronically controlled wastegate and then directly into the catalyst assembly. DIY maintenance on the Lexus RX 500H is as straightforward as any modern vehicle with only a couple of exceptions. The majority of its fluids can be found at the passenger side with engine coolant at the furthermost outboard location. Turbocharger intercooler coolant is just to its right. The engine oil filler cap is at the top passenger side of the engine and can be accessed without removing the sound cover. The oil dipstick is at the front of the engine noted by its bright yellow handle. The oil filter? You have to get underneath the vehicle and access it from below. The brake fluid reservoir can be found at the driver's side near the strut tower. As with all fluids, always consult your owner's manual for the type, grade, and the amounts you'll need. Just ahead of the brake fluid reservoir is the engine computer, and to its right, the main fuse box. It opens easily with the pop of a clip or two, and inside you'll find an included fuse removal tool to help you out. The air filter is located down low on the driver's side ahead of most of these components, and can be easily replaced by popping a couple of clips. No tools are required. Of note, the electric cooling fan is mounted at the back side of the radiator and should be treated with respect as it can turn on any time if the engine is warm, even if the engine is shut off. Also be careful working in or around the orange wiring harness that connects to the hybrid electric motor and the control components as it handles some 288 volts. All right, my friends, there you go. An overview and a quick look under the hood of the Lexus RX 500H the turbocharged hybrid. Now this is an engine and transmission you're gonna find in a lot of upcoming Lexus and Toyota vehicles. This particular one we've got a test drive of, you can see that right there. If you like these nuts and bolts videos, you can also subscribe to TVTV Garage right there. Either way, stay tuned.